Listen to the interview and decide if the statements are true, false, or not stated. Welcome to our program Techno World. Our guest in the studio today is a brand manager for one of the most famous companies producing electronic devices and tech toys, Will Bronson. Hello, Will. Good afternoon. Here is our first question. Everyone knows that the pace at which technology is evolving is having a massive impact on us. How are all of these new technologies changing us? Well, it's changing us in many ways, not just in our spending habits, as people tend to buy more and more gadgets, but also in how we spend our leisure time once we've got our gadgets and tech toys back at home. Compared to five years ago, two thirds of Europeans are now using technological devices. In their everyday lives, if we look back 50 years ago, we only had the post and telephone lines in the house. Even 10 years ago, it was really just the microwave and TV and the cordless phone. But nowadays, people have 10 to 14 different digital devices in their homes. It's a huge increase. So, what are these devices people have in their homes now? We are looking at anything from digital TV to digital radio, satellite navigation, MP3 players, PVR technology, cordless phones, mobile phones, PDAs, and the list goes on. Could you tell us how these devices are going to have to change in the future? Yes, essentially. Nobody wants to have five or six remote controls at home, which means that we, as producers, have to combine several functions into one device. If you can get down to one device, for example, the entertainment PC that combines electronic devices and PC devices, then you've got a product that allows you to have better content, video on demand, music on demand, and the ability to show your photos and share them with your family. I think that any device that can manage all these functions is going to be the one people would most naturally choose. But it doesn't sound to me that this kind of device would be easy to operate. I think any manufacturer of modern electronic devices has to be very clear that what we produce has to be simple. It can't be a headache to set up, and you shouldn't have compromise about what you can do with it. It has to enrich our lives, not make them more complex. For the consumer, that means that when you take something out of the box and plug it in, it's going to work, and your devices have to work together. If you are playing music on your stereo, or if you are projecting TV pictures or a film on different screens around the house, it all has to work together, and it has to work straight out of the box for the consumer to use easily. A very interesting perspective. Thank you, Will, for speaking to us. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye.